So today we're going to talk about a number of APAs on greases, um, APAs on N, H and L. And we're hopefully going to give you some information which will allow you to choose the best grease for your application. So traditionally the most popular grease uh, of the APAs on range that is used for cryogenic applications is APAs on N. Um, and that has been used for making uh, thermal contacts for thermometers for many years. Just press the thermometer into a drilled hole full of grease. Uh, when it freezes, um, you get a thermal contact. Um, and it can also be used for significantly improving the thermal conductivity of pressed metal contacts. That's APAs on N. And that has a, a vapor pressure of better than 10 to the minus 9 millibars at room temperature. If you're going to be going higher than, significantly higher than room temperature, um, up to temperatures as high as 240 Celsius, then APAs on H is going to be the grease that you're going to be wanting to look at. Um, up to room temperature, that has a vapor pressure of 10 to the minus 8 millibars. But the important thing about a, uh, APAs on H is that it doesn't melt, so it doesn't drip all over um, the rest of your apparatus. And then if you're really after the ultimate in uh, low vapour pressure, then APAs on L has a vapour pressure of better than 10 to the minus 10 at room temperature. All these APAs on greases are uh, based upon hydrocarbons, so as a result, solvents such as trichloroethylene, hexane, uh, and even toluene for um, H uh, will be very useful for uh, removing the grease. So uh, those are the APAs on greases, H, N, and L. CMR, Condensed Matter Resources, Laboratory Essentials Direct.